Welcome back to my channel. This is Sherika here. And today's vlog is about my day in the life as a caregiver and just some little things that I do to keep myself motivated and to keep my clients happy. <music> Today I am hard at work. I am taking care of my client today. She's not feeling very well. And it gave me an opportunity to clean her house up because she's not looking. You know how sometimes your client be like, um, don't do that today. And I'll be like, yeah, what else you want me to do today? So anyway, I am on my way upstairs to put her clothes in the dryer. I had to go on two different floors. Some people are really loud behind me. I had to go on two different floors to do her laundry because there's only two washers per floor. And it's every other floor. So if she lives on the first floor, I got um, laundry on the second and the fourth floor. So today is a different vlog today. Showing you what some of what I do for some of my clients. Today, like I said, my client is not feeling well. So it gave me some time to clean her house, which you will see. And now I'm on my way to go put her laundry in the dryer. So come along with me. I wanted to get back on here because I was thinking maybe that this um, elevator light was getting out. Oh, this is the third floor. Are you going up? Somebody came in the elevator with me. <laughs> and I had not got really like used to um, like recording in public. <laughs> that to me, oh, look at this lighting. Girl, we girls looking real pretty. No filter. No that, no filter. But I just walked into the laundry room. This this way is not that good. But this way, that light, that lighting is heading. So anyway, I am going to set the camera up and let you watch me put my client's clothes in the dryer. They are done. So just give me one second and I will pop back in here with you guys. Oh, this lighting, girl. See, that's how I know that I'm not gonna be able to do this vlogging thing because I don't have a camera spinning the wrong way. And nobody said anything. <laughs> but anyway, I am on my way to the next floor so that I can put the other two in the dryer. So that's where I'm on my way to. I will see you guys in just a second. Or let me say, I just want to talk in the hallway. Oh, maybe they're not out here now. I'm on my way to the second floor. Yeah, there's nobody out here. I heard some people talking. Like I said, I want to be a little discreet. Not a, mm, maybe I do, I don't know. I just thought, like I said, I find it a little bit weird to like be recording yourself in public. So that's why I kind of hadn't been doing it. That's why I'm talking really low, even though there's nobody around. But I do hear somebody talking nearby. So anyway, the elevator's getting ready to pick me up and I think it's somebody in there. We'll see, hold on. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Good. So sweet. <laughs> I do not really care for recording in public. I really don't. It's an adjustment for me. I'm not gonna say I, you know, like it's horrible or anything. It's just an adjustment. This light, something about the when the light hits this way, hey. It is just really, really nice. So anyway, I am down on the second floor. It looks like one of them are done. One of the loads are done. See, it's zero, zero. And then the other one looks like it has like a couple minutes left. So let me hurry up and put this stuff in the dryer so that I can get back to my client because like I said, she's not feeling well. So I'm just like kind of monitoring her. All three loads in the dryer now. So that means I have an hour until everything gets done. And then I will fold everything up and put it away when I get into my client's house. And then after that, I'm gonna be pretty much gone. You know, I'm gonna leave that day. And then I'm gonna do some other work today. So we'll see what we're gonna get into because I have a little bit of time in between my next client. So we'll see how that goes. So yes, follow me today and work. Hey y'all. Me and my client, we was just 
I know it's probably hard to hear me. I got the, I could just pick the basket up, just being lazy. But um, <laughs> me and my client was having a deep conversation. Hello. Good, are you coming up? Yes, I'm doing laundry. Yep, it is laundry day. Yep. You have a good day. Thank you. Wait. Every single time I'm gonna try to bring cooler in this hallway and be somebody here with me. It also is washing, so I need to hurry up and get my stuff out of here. You know what I like to do? I like to just kind of like fold everything before I get back downstairs. Sorry about that. And now it's time to go back down to the second floor. That was the stuff that I put in second, so that's why I went there. Let's see who I end up seeing in the hall. Very well, how are you? Good. So, I got to get in the elevator and find myself. I come on way to the second floor to get the rest of the money, all of the dryers, and then I'm gonna go I'm gonna go back to my client and put everything away. Yep. Oh, it stink on this. Oh, some weird smell coming from somebody's apartment. Okay. Got my finger in front of the camera again. So it looks like one of them are done and the other one is like one minute so let me get this stuff out of here Once I got back into my client's house, I just put away the laundry and then I pretty much said goodbye to her. My next client ended up sending me a text saying that I did not have to come. So I decided to Instacart. On my free time, I try to do a little bit of Instacart. Y'all, look what I'm doing right now. Thank God this lady had a cart, but she didn't tell me that she had stairs back from her building. With the cart, girl, how am I supposed to get the I'm supposed to get the cart up and down the stairs and all this stuff. Thank God I have my own cart. And I... Alright, I'm gonna go. So after I got off of work, I was like, you know what, let me get home and let me get my house together. There was a lot of things that needed to be done, dusting, sweeping, mopping, vacuuming, kind of like some reorganizing, getting some, you know, some of the kids stuff out of the living room and dining room. So I was like, you know what, let me just get my life together. So I went home and I just went and cleaned. So this is very realistic for me. So just so you know, I already swept 
and vacuum the floor off camera so I didn't just get right into mopping the floor <laughs> I did sweep and um, use my vacuum to go over the floor before I used the Swiffer I know here it kind of shows that I did not move the rug however I did move the rug and I mopped and swept and vacuumed up under the rug before putting it back in its place and then I did the surrounding parts around the rug so please do not think that I didn't do the rug I did I definitely did Thank you for watching my video don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel to see more videos thank you